Ted Nugent has been a rock star for more than 50 years, but he can still talk and think clearly because he hasn't been loaded the whole time. He's been sober the whole time, and he's one of the country's most articulate defenders of our basic constitutional rights, in particular, the right to bear arms. He started a group called Hunter Nation that organizes people who hunt sportsmen to stand up for those rights. For a brand new episode of Tucker Carlson today, we spoke at great length to Ted Nugent, and it was an amazing conversation. Here's part of it. I'm in the political firestorm. I've always been confrontational, especially regarding the Second Amendment and yeah. hunting rights. And I've never been uncomfortable when they attacked me. I go, so, so venison is, you don't recognize its value? You, what do you think deer are here for? If you don't eat them, what are they here for? Um, and carrying a gun, I would be attacked for carrying a gun. I go, so by the way, venison and self-defense are perfect and you're attacking me for carrying a gun and killing deer? What are you, nuts? And of course, they were all stoned. Uh, so I, I, I suppose the inclination would be uncomfortable when you're attacked, but I, I was so confident. You may have noticed this. I'm so confident that the weekend with my dad and brothers deer hunting was perfect. Yeah. Literally perfect. Yes. Balancing the herd, participating in God's miraculous creation as an asset to bring balance and thriving conditions. And training, aim small, miss small marksmanship. I'm a sheriff deputy for almost 40 years now. I train with Delta Force Tucker. Get out of here. And so marksmanship and tactical capabilities to stop evil, could it be anything but perfect? Yeah. It's literally perfect. So my hunting and my guns are perfect. And the beatniks and the hippies would attack me for those things because if you're comfortably numb, you think peace and love happened in spite of the Trail of Tears, in spite of the Bataan Death March. Here's a little battle cry I believe in. You Pearl Harbor me, I Nagasaki you. <laughs> Just, and that keeps us at peace. Yes. The best way to, to keep peace is to be ready to destroy evil. And if you don't destroy evil, it wins. Venezuela, Cuba, China, yeah. Democrats, Chicago. Are you kidding me? Who doesn't see the glaring evidence? So I've always known I was in the righteous camp, not because of my opinion of what's righteous, but I consume evidence. I monitor evidence. I listen to stories. I see John Belushi got high. John Belushi's dead. I went hunting. I'm still Ted. Um, bad behavior, ugly results. Cognizant, conscientious behavior, happiness. So I, and by the way, you know, don't confuse comfortably numb with ultra relaxed. I'm a bow hunter. I spend more hours silent in a tree than all humans combined since Cochise. So Hunter Nation has jumped in where all these alphabet soup organizations have not. And I love that I'm a member of all of Turkey, Duck and Limited, yeah, Pheasants, yeah, Whitetails. What are you got? A, you got a creature. Walleye. Walleye. The, the Trout Unlimited. I love it all. I bet you love that. I, um, I, I know them well. So, so, so HunterNation.org is where it starts. If you really go, what do I do? What do I do? Go to HunterNation.org and see what we're doing because it's not about hunting really. It's about God, family, country, and the traditional values that make people take their lives into their own hands to get here because there's this unique freedom that is guaranteed by those sacred documents. And again, those are just documents. The freedom is already here. I was born with the right to keep and bear arms. I was born with the right to speak up. I was born with the right to privacy from my government intrusion without just cause. I was born with that. I could come here naked without any constitution, and I know I could say what I want to say. I don't have to get the king's permission. Kings, emperors, tyrants, kiss my ass. We are a self-government. We are in charge. We hire people to represent us based on these self-evident truths. And if you, if you infringe on them, we will fire your ass and don't make us arrest you. 
Man, is Ted Nugent an interesting person to talk to. A ball of energy and a very clear thinker and a good guy. Went on for more than an hour. You can find the full episode of Tucker Carlson today on Fox Nation, available right now. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.